Well, hello, folks. Welcome along to the channel. I am the Custer Prophet, and we're back here with our Brentford B to save. We're into season two, and we are right at the end of our Europa League group stages, and it's looking really, really good. It looks like we are almost definitely. I think we'd have to do something quite spectacular to not qualify. I'm not even sure if it's possible. Um, which is exciting. In the league, it's it's going better, as you can see behind me, but we still are sitting just outside of those uh, European places that we got into last time. The problem we seem to be having is when we play anybody in that top seven. We have not beaten one of them home or away. We've not even drawn one of them home or away. All the rest of the, all the wins that we've had, um, all the draws we've had, have been teams from eighth and below. So that is definitely something that needs to change. Right, let's get into it. Right, let's have a look at the results. You can see here, uh, I, I've come back a little bit further on than I said I would. I was going to come back for the Ludogratz game. In the end, I played on. And um, we're going to come back for the Dynamo Bituma game, the Georgian side, 27th in the giant Euro, 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 Europa League groups. When we left off, we had that very, very unlucky draw against Bajiktas. They scored late, late in that one. We followed that up with a nice 2-0 victory over West Ham. This was a good performance, um, but it was uh, we, we worked hard to get that. First half, we weren't that great. Second half, we were much better. Sharda with a goal, uh, and Mendy, an own goal. And it was Tell, actually, who came on, and he, he, he bullied Mendy into scoring that own goal. So I was pleased with that. Coming up against Chelsea, this is a team that we beat, I think, twice last season. Um, we were not able to get anywhere in this game. Nice goal from Joss De Silva to level things up. It was a corker, if I'm remembering rightly. But um, they uh, outplayed us in the second half, and uh, we weren't doing much there. But happy to get a victory against Braga in the next game. De Silva, Henry, and Umbumu with the goals there. And then followed that up with a very nice 3-1 victory against Brighton, Sharda, Pinnock and Mbumu. I thought, right, we're going into this game against Villa. Let's, let's, let's give them a game. We were not bad, actually. We were not bad in this game. 3-2 is how it finished. We lost it. De Silva and Damsgaard were the goals. De Silva, as you can see, is playing pretty well now. He's getting a few games. Uh, and then came back into Ludogorets. That was a nice, comfortable 3-0 victory. Tell getting a goal, which is great. Uh, Almeida and Jensen. City at home, this looks a lot closer than it actually was. City were all over us for most of the game. Uh, we brought on Wisser at the end and he scored two goals, which was nice. So uh, three goals from us, from Umbumu, two from Wisser. It's his first involvement. Um, and uh, yeah, then we, 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 we got him a little bit more involved after that. This was a good away victory because we've not had a lot of them away against Bournemouth. A couple of goals from Sharda. And we've just beaten Stoke 2-0, De Silva and Ben Mee back in the side. So, all in all, it's it's not too bad. We're, we're sitting just outside, three points outside of those European spots. So, we've got games against Everton, West Ham, uh, Arsenal at home, Fulham. So, there's, there's potentially points to gain there. We just need to have more points than the team directly above us, essentially, uh, who are Forest. Right, folks, let's um, let's get in there and see what we're doing in the Europa League. Let's have a look at the league first. So this is where we are. Uh, we are amongst the elite here. Uh, highest points total is 13, and we are on that. Uh, in terms of goal difference, uh, Roma have run away with it, as has Celtic. Uh, and we are not that far behind Chelsea. But the interesting thing here is, as you can see, we can't really, unless we screw up really badly, uh, it's going to be very unlikely for us not to qualify. But if we win this game and win it well, uh, and we can finish in the top two, then it gets interesting because there's actually um, some money available for those top two spaces, which I hadn't realised. It's not a huge amount of money, but, you know, we will take it. If we win the whole thing... £857,000. Thank you very much. I'll take that. So if we do get through that, if we get into this top phase, we don't then play in the uh, the next knockout round. We will essentially find our victim, um, whoever wins through that, and they will play us, which sounds good. So, yeah, this is, this is where we're going. I don't know where the... 
in this format where the Champions League teams drop into? Where do they go? I'm a little confused with that. Okay, it looks like the Champions League looks like that's been phased out. And the Champions League have... That's not the case at the minute, is it? It's definitely not the case at the minute. Champions League uh, are going to have this crazy system as well, by the look of it. So, um, well, that's fun. Anyway, folks, let's get into the game and let's play this side. I'm expecting big things from my side. Now, look at the, look at all the uh, the link lines there. We're playing Brogia and Sharda up top. Damsgaard just behind. Jensen, McGinn and De Silva... Um, in midfield, and then the back line: Henry, Ayer, Pinnock, and Walker Peters. With Flecken, he's back in goal. We've got a couple of people out injured. Uh, one who doesn't really matter, uh, but uh, Norgard or Jan Alt's back, so he will be good to have him. With Norgard out, but the the only other players who are out are just not in the squad. So we've got a pretty strong side out today, and. Um, I'm expecting big things. Damsgaard's not particularly happy. He's not getting lots of game time. But Almeida is starting to play some decent football. So why would you get game time, mate? Right, folks, let's get into it. Let's see what we can come out with. De Silva's playing well. McGinn's doing all right. I've got high expectations here. If we can win and win this big, we're. Uh, I don't think it really affects who we could potentially play. I think we just need to finish in those top eight but you know getting that extra bit of money that's going to be nice right they've got a very small squad i think they've got two it's mainly grayed out players but we've got two brazilians who play for them well mcginn plays it in brosia it's cleared out but uh shard is that you can see we've had a, the chances so far as you might expect and here's De silver he's gonna have a shot from distance surely oh it's in De silver another goal five goals this season he's come back from injury and he is on fire. What a great start. What a great start. This is 1-0 very, very early on. Right, Sharda is next up. Could we see a nice big victory? This would be nice. De Silva, he's already scored one. Oh, McGinn going wide. They are going to be... That hit the post. <laughs> Was that a save? What happened there? I didn't even look at that. It just looked like it had gone wide. But Here we go. Pinnock. Could have turned and shot there. McGinn's got a bit of space. Oh, that was a nice hit. And again, that's another corner. That looked like it had gone wide. Something funny with the the graphics here. And here's Jensen now. <laughs> They're just not clearing it. They don't know what to do. They don't know how to deal with a rampant Brentford side. Well, here's De Silva. It looks like they, they were going on a... No, they no wrong end. Thought they were coming on an attack, but here's Damsgaard, De Silva, and he's just over the top with that one. Right, ball headed down from Ayer. A bit of a mistake from Damsgaard there. Giving it away to the Georgians. Can't be having that. Oh no, they they never had a hope there. McGinn into Jensen. Sharda, Walker Peters down the right side. It's going to run. Chips it in. Oh, off the bar. We are on fire. Right, ball into Jensen. Come on. De Silva. He has been very, very good recently. Brozier. Oh, come on. That's the sort of ball that um, Tony would absolutely gobble up that's when he's really quite good those little low loopy balls he gets over them and heads them down and looks looks quite good actually in the in this game they, those downward headers look really nice Shardas, the ball's cleared out in we go and there we go there we see the downward header Brozier with another goal with 2-0 up well Chelsea are 1-0 up in their game so we're not going to be first if it stays like that. Here's Jensen. It's in. It's in. It's, he had a shot, and it was. It looked like it was just kind of bouncing around in there, but uh, in the end, crept its way in. Let's have a look. Another look at that. Jensen does well. No one closes him down. 
yeah, off the uh, off the far post. Very nice. So we're three 0 up. Absolutely flying, folks. Twenty seven minutes. <laughs> it's this could be quite a long one. <laughs> Ball is just through to Flecken, but you feel we're ready to unleash, unleash the beast here. Henry doing brilliantly down this left side. <laughs> no one comes near him. Over the top, getting the crosses in like this. Well, three 0 at half time. Very, very good. Looked every inch worth of that. So uh, let's get on second half and see if we can score another three. Well, here we go. Pinnock launches it long. Into McGinn. Walker Peters. Look really strong down the left and the right wings. Oh yeah, lovely pass into De Silva. I was going to say threaded the ball through, didn't need to actually in the end. Came short with a threaded ball through, went to Damsgarden with 4-0 up. Very, very good. Oh, Brozier. He's giving it away. <laughs> oh man. Oh, Flecken, he's, he's come out. Well, he's, he's supposed to be playing the sweeper keeper, so that's that's fine. Oh, Sharda, cracking goal. Tenth of the season now. And uh, we are ripping this team apart. Well, Leinhardt and Jan Alton, but it's a corner from them. What are they going to do? They're going to have a shot. Oh, that's pretty good. Look at the crowd. They've got loads of people here. Damsgaard with a corner for us. And it's in. Walker Peters getting his first of the season. It's everywhere. It's just one goal for each of them. Might bring Tell on actually. I think that would be a, a good move. We'll take Brozier off, bring Tell on, bring Almeida on as well for Damsgaard. There we go. Kick off highlight. Oh, it's nice when you have a game like this where we've got a 2 XG and we've scored six goals. Just looks so confident. Oh, what a ball through, Tell. And he scored. It's number seven. Wow. Another new scorer on the score sheet. They're going to run out of paper if they're doing this using paper. Very good. Couldn't get another one, could we? Maybe not. Pinnock now. Here's Leinhardt. Ball over the top. It's Tell. It's Kevin Shard. It's Almeida. He's got... There's another new scorer. Eight goals, eight scorers. Fantastic. This has got to be some sort of record, surely. Apoel got one back against Chelsea. Come on. Let's get nine. Let's get ten. Henry. Oh, it's cleared. Come on. Ten might be enough, you know. It's a penalty. <laughs> I mean... What's a ref giving a penalty away at 8 0, but we will take it. Who's going to take it? Goalkeeper. It is a penalty. Come on, goalkeeper. It's Almeida. Oh, you're going to ruin it now, unless he misses. Oh, boo. <laughs> 9 0. Oh, man. I'm not looking at the league table purposefully. I want to be surprised. Do not concede. Do not concede. It's not allowed. Oh, he's offside. Thank God for that. <laughs> what are you doing? Well, there we go. 9-0. Absolutely fantastic. Goals from De Silva, Brozier, Jensen, Damsgaard, Sharda, Walker, Peters, Tell. And two from Almeida. Now, have we finished top of the league? We've got a lot of goals. But I don't know. Oh, we have, you know. We have Chelsea won their match 3-1. Celtic, who were also doing very well, must have won their match. 1-0. But we finished top. We get a playoff spot. 
which I think means we won't play one of these sides. We'll play one of the other guys who just kind of got through. 540k. I thought it was bigger than that. No, that's nice. Nice performance. Anyway, folks, that will do it. We will absolutely be playing through that and we'll be coming back. <laughs> I don't understand what this is. We'll be coming back to try and understand what on earth this is. Why Why is it this the league phase? Okay, very nice. Anyway, folks, if you didn't like that, hit the like button, subscribe if you're new. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.